In this video, you will learn how to install Pillow Library in the Visual Studio Code Editor. And do hit the like button if you find this video useful. Now, the prerequisite for this installation is that you need to have this Visual Studio Code and the Python installed into your system. And in case you do not have the Python installed into your system, then I have already created a separate video for that and you would find the link of that video in the description below. So once we have the Visual Studio and the Python installed, we will open that Python project in Visual Studio Code for which we want to install Pillow Library. And for that, we will click on this file here, then click on this open. And now we will navigate to the location where our project is present. So for me, it is present inside the downloads folder. So I will go to the downloads folder, then projects and here I will select this pillow project and finally click on this open. Now before installing pillow, we will create a virtual environment for this opened project because it is recommended to have a separate virtual environment for each of the python project. So we will also create the virtual environment first and after that only we will install the pillow library inside the created virtual environment. But in case you already have the virtual environment for your project, then you can skip the creation part and directly activate that and after that you can install the pillow library inside that activated environment. So now to create the virtual environment, first we will open the terminal and for that we will click on this terminal, then select this new terminal here. And now in this terminal, we will type python3 space minus m v e n v space and now we will give the name of the virtual environment which we want to create. So let's say it is my env. So this command is for Mac system but in case you are using windows then you would see the command on screen. Now we will hit enter to execute this particular command. And once this command is executed successfully we will see this my env folder which is created inside our project folder. And this my env folder will have all the necessary scripts and libraries in it. Now we will activate this created environment and for that we will write source space my env slash bin slash activate. Now again this command is for the mac os but in case you are using windows then you would see the command on screen. Now we will hit enter. And as soon as the command is executed, we will see this my env within these brackets, which is the indication that this particular environment is currently active. Now finally, we will install the pillow library in this activated virtual environment and for that we will write pip3 space install space pillow. And once this is installed, we will see this message of successful installation. Now to verify the installation, let's print all the libraries that are currently installed in the current activated environment. So let me first clear the terminal so that it would be better visible to you. Now we will run the command which is pip space list. So this will list down all the packages which are installed in the currently activated environment. And here we will see this pillow library also which has this particular version. And now we will write a small python script which will verify whether this pillow library is installed properly or not. So first we will create a python file and for that we will click on this new file icon here. And now we will give the name of the file. So let's say this is main.py. So this main.py file is created inside this pillow project folder. Now in this file, first of all we will import the pillow module. So we will write import then pil and also we will print the version of pillow. So we will write print then pil dot underscore underscore version underscore underscore. Let's now save this file using command and s. And now to run this program, we will again come to the terminal and type python space main.py so here in the output we did not get any error and we got this version of pillow which is same as this one so the pillow library is installed properly and we can use this for our python projects now 
so now let me know in comments if this video was useful to you and make sure to hit the like button